what's going on screaming eagles this jet eagle 101 here welcome back to the walking dead in our last video we just escaped the motor end in the rv lily killed carly over an argument of stolen meds and everything and we decided i decided to keep lily with us and everything and well she just took off in our rv after we made it to the train so now Lily's gone, so it's just Kenny's family, Ben, and Clementine, and Lee, so we're going to see if we can try to get the train moving, so let's go do that, so let's see here. I'm going to talk to Katja. I'm sorry about the RV. I'm worried. We're really on our own out here now. Well, we're putting some time into this train. Worst comes to worse, boxcar safe enough to sleep in. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Mm -hmm. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. Mm-hmm. How's that? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. I better get back to it. Huh. All right. <clears throat> Alright, no, not the box car. Uh, yeah. Climb this up here. Let's go over here. We found this in the box car back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This hoss will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. I wouldn't mind plowing through some walkers. That's the spirit. Nothing about the train. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Six five, so okay. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Ooh. Now we're talking. I better check make sure I get everything right. Yep. All right. Well, now we gotta go to nine. Nine should be around here somewhere. Nah, that's just where the wrenches are. Turn left, then right. All right. Oh, 
Holy shit! We're golden! Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's mm. fucking enjoy this. Yeah, Mom, let's see if she'll move. All yours. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Hey, Ken. What's up? I'm sorry about the RV. Keeping her was my call. This one's on me. Radiator's fucking hosed in that thing, so she won't make it 30 miles. We figure this train out, and maybe it turns out she did us a favor. All right, then. Yep. See, we're all good now. We didn't have to worry about that RV. Let's check on Clementine. See if she's alright. Concerned about her. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Yeah, me neither. And Ben, are you okay, Ben? Have you heard or seen anything out here? No sign of whatever lives in the train. Keep it down. I don't want you scaring the kids. All right. Hey, Kenny, we're loose! Let's go in here. You touch any of my stuff? Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Hmm. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Mm-hmm. So that's it? We're cut loose? 
Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Oh, Kenny's scared. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Well, here we go. Let's do this. Training. <clears throat> uh. <clears throat> Riding on the train. So it gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> there were more of us. Dad, get them? No. Ah, living got them. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. <coughs> oh no. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. All right. This train stopped right quick. Yep. Alright, well, you're telling me the good stop the train? Okay, we'll stop the train. Even before just a little bit. You need to stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. He won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. This isn't about Doug. The hell it's not. You think we're pals and you know me? You're some elitist prick with a fancy education who could pick me apart? It's not like that. The fuck it isn't. How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! Uh. 
I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. I've had your back. Don't make me fucking regret it. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Always been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Mm. Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's... Here, or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Mm-hmm. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest, so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Oh, Duck is starting the turn. That's not good. No, 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 not good. his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine.
we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. <sighs> I'm doing this for you, Kenny. I don't want you to kill your own son from turning. I'm sorry, Duck. I'm sorry, Kenny, that this happened. I didn't want this to happen, and I didn't want you to do it. I'm sorry about your wife, Katja. How you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Go she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Mm-hmm. That is true. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, though, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and, and they just don't work out. I like a drink. You know? Yeah. 
got any. No. Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. Okay. I'm gonna talk to Kenny. Hey, man. You and me, we... Uh, oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. You still want to get a vote? It's still the best plan. Can. It's the best plan. Hey. Yeah? I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure... Cat... would be, uh, okay with you. So forget it. Okay. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Alright, alright. Alright, I'll leave you alone, Kenny. Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. See ya. Yeah. Hmm. It's a fifth of whiskey. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath. Right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, it's a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Aim lower. A bit to the right. Okay, a little higher. A little bit more to the left. A little 
little bit lower. Aim more to the right. Steady now. Almost got it. I got it. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Good shot. Good job, Clementine. To the right. Aim lower. There you go. Nice. I did it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See? You did good. They're not walkers, though. No. Far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Hey, Clint. Hi. So, you're probably not gonna like this. Oh, no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Mm-hmm. Do you know how to do this? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. No, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, so I'm actually going to end the video from right here because this seems like a good stopping point at this moment. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button. If you got something to say about it, hit down in the comment section. If you want to be part of the Screaming Eagles for more exclusive content, hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification for more upcoming videos by Jet Eagle 101. Have a good one.